Energy Vibration Reading for all the Sun, Moon and Rising Tauruses. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, this is going to be a wonderful month for you Tauruses because this is the month of the Earth Energies, whatever you were planning and you were acting yourself is it's a good idea. Go ahead and do it because it's going to be positive. It's going to come out very good. You are going to not realize how wonderful this month is going to be for you Tauruses okay justice whatever that was injustice in your life there is going to be a balance there is finally going to be a balance love soulmate relationship is in the first week a lot of people are having this um, in the second week we are having the seven of cups a sort of a dreamy week but with positive you're dreaming about your financial situation and this is positive the third week you're going to be sacrificing something your third week is not going to be one of the best positive weeks on anything to do the fourth week is the ending to something there is a transformation and the ending to something so let's see what is happening um, there's two transformation um, endings. So transformation. This is the five, the four of ones. This is the four of ones. So a balance. Whatever that was unbalanced is going to be balanced. There's a transformation. The fourth week you have the energy of. Uh, the eight of a swords in the reverse form this is good because you're finally seeing what is going on and the Sun comes out okay let's look and see what and the number seven is going to be a number that you need to carry number seven is going to be that it's positive you're on a positive journey ahead number three is going to be also playing a significant role seven and three the sixes are also going to be playing a significant role in your life in this week uh, i saw the eight also so you have uh, the sign of infinity you have twice the eight the energy of the sun is positive in the last week so your first week your last week is going to be a very positive week third week is not going to be as positive as we would have expected it so let's look and see what is going on as we look at destiny so there is going to be a lot of soulmate connections a lot of soulmate soulmate this is soulmate this is real love a lot of soulmate connection there is going to be also a lot of money coming in so um, this you have uh, the energy of the Sun of uh, the Pentacles so some people the wheel uh, the destiny of money is going to be coming to you and love money and love this is destined for you Tauruses in the first week money some people will have money and receive money some people will receive love as we move on we in the second week it is a week of justice justice came up twice in your reading so whatever injustice whatever imbalances whatever lies that has been told all of these are clearing up there are good things that are coming in dream of new things dream of new realities because what I'm seeing here is that there has been so much that you Tauruses have to overcome and has been overcoming because you're an earth sign and your hair being strong and standing up and dreaming and trying to make a new future a better future for yourself and it's going to happen the third week as I said is a week of sacrifice and when we sacrifice we give up something and here you have the seven of swords the seven of swords which whatever that has been stolen or taken away there is something that has been stolen or taken away there's a blockage and I'm going to ask what is this blockage because um, there is something well it's not whatever that was stolen 
um, is being returned and um, let's see what is this all about um, emotion emotion as you have uh, blocked emotion as uh, um, your heart was broken as uh, someone stole your heart and uh, it, this is going to be returned to you and you're going to heal yourself from this a lot of people it's as if you're psychic it's as if you were very psychic and it was blocked or somebody stole it it's going to be returned to you and your psychic is going to get much much stronger okay in the fourth week um, we have the energy of transformation whatever the situation was whatever um, the four of ones is always a uh, um, house um, whatever that was uh, um, if there is an ending and let's ask because this is given of so many mixed message so what is it that you would like to tell us about this situation a secret a secret is going to come out whoever has a secret a secret is going to come out and there is going to be a transformation whatever is happening there's a secret a lot of secrets are coming out for a lot of sign in this month um, it's as if the universe is opening up and you know the lies that was been told and that sort of a thing a lot of secrets a lot of things are opening up in the fifth week we have the eight of swords so this is good because whatever the secret was that came out in the fourth week you have the eight of swords in reverse and now you're seeing clearly and uh, the Sun is coming out that means um, the universe is bringing you clarity if you weren't thinking clearly the universe is bringing you clarity about a situation and this is a positive whatever the situation is whatever the clarity is whatever the situation is you're seeing that the universe is going to bring clarity to a situation that you weren't seeing clearly so this month is a positive there's a lot of, there's going to be a lot of trans transition transitioning that is happening in your world and in this month for a lot of people whatever is happening is that I can tell you that justice is going to prevail so if you guys had what um, situation legal situation legal matters justice is going to prevail and in a good good way so let's um, see transformation whatever secrets that was there is going to finally come out and with that secret coming out you're going to see clearly what was happening okay and then you are going to make changes let's see what is happening for the Sun people you're going to be working with mercury and the Venus that's two planets <laughs> three planets and Neptune and the moon people you're going to be working with the Virgos and Pluto Ooh, the Virgos and Pluto and the Aquarians so wow okay so as I said before the Sun people are going to be working with three major major planets and that is Mercury Venus you're going to learn to manifest you're going to learn to love again and you are going to learn to listen to the intuition okay this is going to be good this is going to be positive as we look at the moon people let's see what is happening for the moon people and the people who are born in the night we are having the energy of the Virgos which is another heart sign which is very wonderful the Virgos are very psychic people you guys are more a business materialistic person but the Virgos are going to work with the planet of Pluto and uh, um, and the Aquarians to make something to make changes so whatever the situation is whatever is happening they are going to be working to make sure that changes is 
is going to happen in your life so be aware of where these changes are and how these changes are going to happen for you so the first week then the last week it's going to be good the third week is a week where whatever your emotional was uh, that you feel blocked with your inform uh, in your emotions that is going to be ill and sort of a listen to your emotion if you feel as if you need to cry if you need whatever is it that you need to do do it in this month heal yourself and secret is going to come out in the fourth week be ready for this secret because you are finally going to see clarity to a situation let's come up and we're going to ask um, the energy vibration to show us what is the vortex the vortex for what is it for the Tauruses um, I'm missing something was the Tauruses reading so easy my relationships are um, supposed to feel good so your life is supposed to feel good to you before you were born you knew that the primary control component of your physical being that would offer the greatest value for personal and collective passion and joy would be the relationship that you would experience with each other it was your plan to relinquish the destiny of your relationship and choose from them the details that would make up your creation and here you are so we choose whatever relationships we want to be with whatever the um, situation is we choose to be in this situation so we can learn certain lessons and sometimes we walk away from things and we don't know what was the lesson but we will know and find and see what the lesson was so somehow I'm feeling as if I am missing something because of the time that the clock is saying but whatever is happening there is a secret and I can't do anything there's something that you are not aware of about a situation that is going to come out the third week is not going to be a positive week and that is the crowning of this month but it's not going to be a positive week but what you should understand is that whatever injustice whatever you have dealing with in the legal aspect of things it's going to work out your last week is going to be powerful because finally you're seeing clarity you're understanding what is going on around you I want to say to each and every person out there life begins when we start to see clearly then we are here able to make certain decisions in our life because as you look at who all these people and these planets that are helping you as a Taurus you're understanding that changes are here and changes is about to happen okay so this is good I can't seem to find except um, a lot of you in the first week is going to connect with your soul mate and twin flame which is extremely extremely good so I want to say to you Taurus it's going to be a good month relationships are very important in this month so go ahead go for it uh, and understand where you are um, be aware of whatever you give out is what you're going to be receiving that is the team of this month namaste please remember to listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign and choose the right things namaste